game of the year took place in Montreal, with the Dodgers matching up Oral Hershiser against the Expos' Pasquale Perez. Pitching duel, right? Precisely. But who could have guessed 21 scoreless innings and a six-hour, 14-minute marathon that showed no sign of letting up? The Pasquale pitch hit on the ground to Foley, who will throw Griffin out, and the inning is over. First time tonight we've seen the Pasquale pitch was the one-two pitch. Struck him out swinging, a slider down and away. Again, Hershiser knows what he's doing out there. There may not be a lot of runs scored in this here baseball game with these two fellas pitching. To this point, Jerry, wouldn't you have to say that the stuff by both pitchers has been darn good? This is true. But while the pitchers pranced like peacocks, the hitters failed to find a way to light the fire. Then in the eighth, the Dodgers lost their starting catcher as Mike Sosha pulled a hamstring. And was only fair that since the Dodgers lost a key performer, the Expos had to lose one too. There was no joy in Montreal. The mighty Yuppie was out. They want Yuppie off the Dodger dugout. He's bugging the Dodger players, and Tom Lasorda is out. And third base umpire Bob Davidson is throwing Yuppie out of the ball game. He wants him off the Dodger dugout. Tommy Lasorda has put up a complaint. This will draw the ire of the fans. They're calling somebody no. from security They're over. They're going to call security and remove him from the ballpark. We've seen it all now, huh? Yuppie's been thrown out of the game, off the Dodgers <laughs> dugout. Well, if you're sitting in that dugout, which has a tin roof on the top of it, and this guy keeps jumping up and down on it, that's uh, pretty disturbing, I would have to say. So I merely suggested to him that if he wanted to jump on the dugout, why doesn't he jump on the home team's dugout, too? That guy, he deserved it. He was a real pain. The Dodgers had other problems, like 22 straight innings without drawing a walk. Harris at third, Murray at first, and he struck him out on a palm ball. Brent Smith gets out of the inning, Hatcher goes down swinging. Everyone here knows that he's capable of ending it with one swing. The 0-2 pitch, called third strike, he struck out the side. Five strikeouts for Pena. He's nasty. Finally, a Montreal rally in the 16th filled the bags with just one out. Infield in, outfield in, and visions of bedtime danced in Mike Fitzgerald's head. Cruz, run trying to score, he's gonna be... Sorry, the Expos win! Larry Walker slides in under the tag by Dempsey, and now the Dodgers will appeal to see if he left too soon, and he did, he is out! Wait a minute, wait a minute, this game is not over, Walker left too soon! Again, in the bottom of the 21st, the Expos sought to end the string of goose eggs. Two on, two out for Tim Wallach. But the man who replaced Sosha came up big. Here's the pitch, and it's high, a pickoff throw to first, and Reigns is going to be out! They picked Reigns off! I watch Eddie at first base, and uh, there was an old sign that Eddie used to have, uh, you know, uh, used to give me in Baltimore, and it just kind of came back to me. I saw Eddie giving me that sign, and. And I said, oh, heck, why not? You know, when the pitch was on its way, I could see from peripheral vision Eddie was breaking, boom, I just let it go to first base and we got it. It was like the old days. And how often do you see it? A guy makes a great play and then leads off the top of the 22nd. Uh-oh, this ball game now has the Dodgers on top. One to nothing on a long home run by Rick Dempsey on a 2-1 pitch into the bleachers in left field. The Dodgers super sub had them now leading by a thread, and the eye of the needle stared back blankly at the Expos. And although Montreal got a man to first in the bottom of the 22nd, with two outs, the Dodgers sewed it up. Hudler running, the pitch is high, the throw by Dempsey will be in time and the ball game is over. You can almost bet your paycheck that, the, that he's going to run with two strikes because he can't give the hitter a chance to strike out. We had him the whole way. I could have <laughs> ate a sandwich before I threw that ball down there. With Dempsey doing everything but rolling out the tarp, the man he replaced had a game or two to recover. I was hurt in the eighth inning. By the time the game was over, I was, I was healed and ready to go. It was fun to win that ball game. 
This is Warner Fusell. Major League Baseball Magazine is presented.